Hi guys, it's Ethan from Sailor Fang Tong back with another post-match interview after the Tanjong Bahar game. 6-1, what a scoreline. What do you think? What do you guys think of the scoreline? I think it went amazing. It was an easy game. Basically, Lion City Sailors break Tanjong Bahar. I, I don't know how sailors eat jaguars, but it happened. Eh? Yeah. <laughs> now, how, you, how are you guys feeling about the scoreline? We haven't won a game 6-1 since the Japanese game. Ooh. Excited. Excited, yeah. yeah. Definitely happy. Looking forward for the next few games. Next few games after the Thailand. <laughs> oh, and down to the final question. Who do you think is the best player, the man of the match? Anu! Anu Pantan! Are you guys big, fan? Are you guys big fans of Anu? Of course! <laughs> uh, you, guys have, you, uh, you guys have heard it from them. Uh, really, thank you so much for your support. Uh, thank you for doing this interview with us. We hope to see you guys at the next game. Alright guys, and I have here with me Ismail and Ashari. So guys, 6-1. It's yeah. been a long time since we won 6-1. There was a Tampanese game the last time we won 6-1. What do you guys think of the scoreline? It's a very, actually, it's a very good result because uh, Tanjo Paga is known for their counter-attacking and their comeback. But somehow today, we are the first team to manage to hold them and defeat them. I mean, their first loss for the league. Yeah, and good for us to win uh, and uh, today game and uh, show them that we are the, uh, show them a good momentum for them to win all the way. Well, uh, Tanjo Paga is certainly one of the most informed sides of uh, the league. Going to the Champions League, what kind of statement do you think this is going to make? Uh, okay, it's be realistic. Yes, it's going to be hard for us. But what, the more, what matter most is we try our best. And I believe in them, we can at least get a few points. And win all the, the way. And win all the way. And go qualify to the next round. Will you guys be watching next Friday's game? Uh, sadly enough, I got work to do. Sorry guys. It's against Euro, by the way. <laughs> yes, I try my best to go and watch all the, all the SS game. Every, all, all the match. Well, guys, the Terry offers they may be live screening, so just keep a keep an eye on LCS socials. By the way, guys, last question before we end off: Who do you think is your man of the match? It's definitely go to Diego. His touch, his passing is totally superb. And same, uh, same to me is Diego Lopez. <laughs> and I guess I'm, I'm gonna go with Diego as well. He played superb. He hardly scores any braces, and he has done it today. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for doing this with us. Uh, we really hope to see you around the next games. Of course, Ashari, I know you've been around for very long, but guys. Thank you for doing this interview and uh, see you guys around and continue supporting sailors. Shine with us, you know, when, whenever you feel like it. Anyways, uh, th thanks guys and see you guys again. Okay, well, see ya. Let's go sailors! So guys, so that wraps up today's post-match interview. I'm really, really in awe for this game, you know. 6-1, you don't, as I said, you don't really win by this scoreline every day. But anyways, uh, thanks to those guys who agreed to participate in the interview and uh, of course to the club as well for this amazing performance. So now it's on to the Champions League and Eddie will be in Thailand. Unfortunately, he's not here today because uh, of certain commitments. This I'm taking over. Uh, well, the lights went out, but I'm taking over the interviewing duties today. Oh my. <laughs> Eddie will be in Thailand and he's going to be bringing you live vlogs from the Champions League in, in Thailand. So uh, we're really looking forward to that. It starts next Friday. Anyways, I guess uh, it's getting late already. So this is uh, Ethan from Sailor Fan Talk signing out.